It's soup season, so let's make a classic tomato soup and grilled cheese. I firmly believe that the best soups don't follow an exact recipe and are mainly used to use up old ingredients that you have laying around your house that are about to spoil. However, I will list what I used in this recipe on your screen. Anyways, I roasted all my vegetables in the oven at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for 45 minutes and then I broiled them for a little bit just to get some color. I added all those ingredients into a pot along with all the drippings, two cups of chicken stock and some fresh herbs, basil, rosemary, thyme, and some salt and pepper. After bringing that up to a boil, I used a stick blender to get that as smooth as I possibly can. If you don't have a stick blender, just use a normal blender. That's okay too. Add in some cream, add in Parmesan cheese, and let that simmer for a while while we prepare our grilled cheese. A few tricks to get the best grilled cheese, in my opinion, is to use mayonnaise instead of butter. It spreads easier and I think cooks better. Use plenty of cheese, like three or four slices, and cook at a low temperature, like a medium low temperature, so you can slowly cook it to make sure all that cheese gets melted and incorporated together, and you don't overcook the crust and you don't want it burnt. I like to dish mine up with some fresh grated Parmesan cheese and some fresh basil, and then the cheese pulls more for me, but you're gonna enjoy it too. Let me know in the comments what you'd like to add to your tomato soup. I think roasted red pepper is a must. Also, is there anything better to dip in a tomato soup than grilled cheese? Anyway, it's getting cold outside, so 